Hello everyone, welcome to BanjoExpert.com. Today we're going to go over a little tune called Long Journey Home. I'll play it through once for you and then we'll slow it down and, and learn it lick by lick. So here we go. So right from the top, we're going to play this open uh, D string, which is the fourth string. You're going to play it twice with your thumb after you do a pinch. So first thing you do this. Okay, so here we go. There's the two ba uh, D notes. And you're doing that pinch on third string and first string. So here we go. And then it's kind of fifth string, third string. And then you're going to fret the second fret of the D string, the fourth string. And you're going to slide it to the fifth. And that's fo followed by a forward roll that you go through twice. And you can kind of play that up a little different. You don't have to play it exactly like I'm playing it. Okay, I'll play it one more time, really slow. It's important that you hit that third string open right before you do the slide from two to five on the four string. Right here. That's a G note that's in the song. So that's the first part. Basically focusing on the two open uh, D notes on the four string with your thumb, and then focus on hitting that third string with your thumb also open, and then second to fifth fret slide. And then you're going to do the little two to three slide that we do all the time. Um, like that. You slide up to two to three, or you can go two to four, whichever one you want. So you can either slide, uh, let's say for now, let's go two to four with a forward roll. Then you're going to do a come back down backwards and do a pull off three to two. And land on open. So here we go, real slow. One more time so you can catch it. So from the beginning. going to do that little double pinch that fifth string first string and then third uh, third string it sounds like that it's kind of a, a pinch and then you're you're uh, hitting the third string as well and you're going to do the slide again we're working our way to the C chord and we're going to lead into this C chord by hitting the third fret on the fourth string so that's the direction that we're going and we're just kind of doing these slide from two to four or two to three and then the pull-offs to get this the the nature of the song like what you would hear the vocals sing So we're going to lead from this, the, the key notes you want to remember is the 3rd fret, the C chord, and then the open D. That's the direction that we're going. 
Okay, so you can keep that in mind as we're playing it. Tune a hair here. So. And you're basically, when you're coming back through to that G chord, you're going to land on that with a forward roll for a minute. And you can go right into C to make it simple, and then to the D, or you can do the third. So you can, you can mix that up however you want, but basically, remember you're leading to the C chord, and this you're doing this so that you can lead the band. Um, let's see, where are we at here? Then you just kind of repeat over. Now to end it, we're going to jump up to this D string. And you're going to do the old Foggy Mountain Breakdown hammer on. And then you're going to do a pull off. And then you're going to do this. Which is kind of a hammer pull off uh, in sequence there. And that's a little lick that I play a lot that kind of might sound difficult, but it's really easy. And all you're using is your thumb and your middle finger. Your thumb and your middle. So you're hammering, then you're hitting open first. You're pulling off, hitting an open first again. It's kind of a neat little sound. however you want with a little pull-off lick. Now, I'll show you a little lick that you can use at the end if you want to throw in a chromatic lick. It just sounds like this. And all you do is you put your uh, index finger on the third uh, fret of the first string, your ring finger on the fifth fret of the second string and you play that those two notes and then you're going to play those same two strings again but you're going to play them open like that and then you're going to do a pull off that little thumb uh, middle finger pull off Kind of want to get that droning sound in there. And down to open G. And you can kind of make that punchy by going. -da 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 -da. Hit that third string, third fret heart. Okay, I'll play it through again real slow. So you can try to catch it all together. Feel free to back up this video and watch it as much as you want. This is pretty simple tune, but it's got some little stuff in it um, that really will spice up your banjo playing like this. That little hammer pull on pull off stuff, and then the the little chromatic. Okay, here we go. First part. Hope you've enjoyed Long Journey Home. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.